So we are about to enter the portal for the first time in Soda Dungeon. So we just beat all the levels of the first dungeon. There's a hundred of them, and we beat the boss. That's a different video though. And we are going to go through the portal. Are you sure you want to activate the portal? Yes. The game will reset. You will lose all of your gold, equipable items, and sodas. However, you will receive unique and permanent treasures whenever you reset. A new and stronger dungeon boss awaits. Proceed to the next dimension. So, yes. This is what it does. Something's beginning in apparently a foreign language in the game. And it says, oh, sorry, I always forget which languages are used in this section of the universe. Ahem. Greetings, traveler. Who or what I am is not important right now, but know this your work is appreciated. With a gesture of my gratitude, I would like to present you with a relic. Yes, those very same relics that your realm has searched for since the dawn of time. Up here all along. How silly. Anyway, choose wisely. Hmm. So I guess it's HP, attack, or MP. Um, surprisingly, HP seems the most important. Uh, let's see. Oh, it gives me options. Okay, so I get plus 5 HP per relic level for each party member. Plus 2 attack. That's all about that. You know, I'm still going to go with HP. Confirm the selection of this relic? Yes. Excellent! I have one more gift for you as well. Relic of Soda Junkie. Soda Junkie only grants twitchy skill. Also gives plus 2 HP, attack, MP per relic level. And now, friend, your destination approaches. We will meet again! And now after this, I'm pretty sure the dungeons give more gold? Welcome to the next dimension. Make use of your relics to ascend the dungeon quicker. Use the new icon in the upper right if you want information on your relics. New treasures await beyond dungeon level 100. Here's the relics. And in order to power up, we need... You have no essence, which is required to power relics. Obtain it. Creatures in the dungeon. Yeah, so now I'm pretty sure that... You know, oh, you actually keep the tavern upgrades, too. That's actually nice. They said he resets everything, I thought, but apparently not. Keep the tavern upgrades. Keep the... Whatever this guy's called, I forget what he's called. Except his items reset. He's back to basically level 1. So, yeah. We'll grab an entire party of soda dungeons and go real fast and show what's going on here. Oh, it, it resets your sodas, though, so you can't just, like, get super good people immediately. Alright. Party of five soda junkies. And we'll see how much gold we get now by comparison. Enemies now have a chance of dropping essence. Look for enemies with a strange glow around them. Use it to power up your relics. So this one, like, is just immediately, of course, the first one that goes at the tutorial. Then we got one essence. Oh, I thought I got some special ability with my soda junkies, but apparently I did not. Maybe I was supposed to activate it. Uh, so you don't get more gold, actually. I'm getting the same amount of gold. It just appear appears to be all based around the relics and what they give. So this is definitely the same amount of gold. So it'd probably be a good idea before a reset to... Uh, I can just turn this on auto. Before a reset of a world, you should probably collect a bunch of gold with your high level parties over the last like, you know, 50 levels of the dungeon, get a bunch of things unlocked, and then move on, so you'll have all the, you know, tables unlocked, tavern upgrade, just upgrade the tavern, that's the one thing to stay, so upgrade the tavern as much as you can, within reason, before starting resetting. But yeah, that's, that's what resetting does in this game, there's not really much else to say about it. Unless I get something crazy in the treasure. But no, it's it's the gold's gonna be exactly the same. You can get essence now to power up the relics, but 
Um, yeah, it's basically the same game all over again, man. Uh, the enemies are even the same and everything. It's just, uh, get those relics. Yeah, now, now you know what happens when you do a reset or go through the portal on Sodanum. 